In this video, we're going to tackle a problem where you get a message that says no signal on your TV when trying to use the Amazon Fire Stick. Okay, so you have a no signal on your TV when trying to use the Fire Stick. This could be caused by one of several issues, and we'll cover the simple ones first. First up, just be sure that it's on the correct input. I mean, maybe sometimes it gets... Uh, change to a, a different input and just try uh, hitting the input button on your remote to switch it or there is usually a method to do it with a button on the television itself. Next thing to be sure of is that you're actually using a power block, not a USB port. Be sure that it's one that supplies 5 watts of power to the uh, to the device, it, the spec should be 5.25 volts, one amp, five watts. And even if it worked before, it uh, doesn't matter. Some updates can come in and require more power. I'll turn it around here and uh, another thing that can cause the no signal is maybe there's some debris blocking the port. So you wanna take everything, take, uh, take the cables out of all of the ports and just be sure that there's no little bit of debris that could be blocking the connections. I like to use canned air. If you have it around, you could use a vacuum cleaner or anything that'll that'll blow the air out. Also, if there's another HDMI port, you may just want to plug it into that one. My, my TV here only has one, but if you have multiple HDMI ports, try plugging it into a different one and it, it might work. All right, if you've tried all of that and you're still experiencing some problems with a no signal, you might want to try to simply unplug the television and let it set for about 20 seconds and then plug it back in once the 20 seconds has elapsed. This will usually allow to, the hardware to maybe reset itself. Maybe there's a problem with the HDMI port. It needs to be reset. Uh, some models of television you can reset by just pressing and holding the power button while it's plugged in for 20 to 30 seconds. If you're not sure how to perform a reset on your television, Seek the documentation provided with your television and they should tell you, they should explain how to perform a reset or a factory reset. And hopefully with one of these tips, you've gotten back up and running. Hope this video worked for you. If this video helped you, please like and subscribe. And for tips like this and more, visit StreamersWorld.com.